Hi everyone, welcome to today's tutorial. Today we will be demoing the Choice Eliminator 2 Google Forms plugin. Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, as you can see, we have a form already set up. It is a t-shirt pre-order form. Uh, and what we'd like to see happen is for visitors take this survey and have choices eliminated. So in other words, let's say in this scenario you only have 10 extra small shirts available. Well, we want forms to keep, keep a record of each time somebody chooses that. Uh, so when there aren't any more extra small shirts left, uh, it is discontinued as an option in this form. In other words, people won't see it to pick. All right, so uh, here's how we set this up. We already have the Choice Eliminator 2 plugin installed. Uh, here it is. I'll click on the icon and then select Choice Eliminator 2. All right, at this point, click Configure. All right, you'll see a note from the author. You can go ahead and close out of that. So at this point, what we're going to do is we're going to set a value for each of the options here. Okay, so we'll click here and then check the box that says eliminate choices so it's going to create this scenario for us whereby some of the options won't appear after a certain threshold has been uh, reached alright so to set that number simply click the choice options icon here so extra small we're gonna say we only have uh, let's say we only have five of these uh, we have ten and everything else except for XXL. In that case, we only have five as well. All right. Uh, if everything is set, uh, you can go ahead and close out of this and close out once more. All right. Okay, it's, uh, it's ready to go. Let's go ahead and preview this form. All right, they're gonna choose extra small and submit it. Okay, I'll submit another response here. All right, one more time here. I'll submit that. Now it shouldn't be an option anymore when I see the form again. Ah, see? Extra small is gone because we've reached that threshold of five. All right, hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching today's tip. If you have any questions, feel free to email me. And if you like videos like this, be sure to subscribe.